over the years, women have taken leading roles in the entertainment sector. I mean, so many of them want to be bosses, want to be taking managerial roles and, you know, um, earn control over their crafts. But do their relationships suffer in the pursuit of these career uh, goals? Now, Lady Pons, one of Cameroon's big good sea legends, I'll, I'll call her that because she's earned it over mm, the years. Yeah. Her one-year marriage to her husband, Alois Yumi, is over. But you know what? The husband was very fast to tell the whole world what really happened. That's according to him. And according to him, he blamed it on infidelity, um, disrespect, and fraud. Which is really sad. Well, we are sorry about that whole marriage, but Elonge <laughs> and, and Yana, when a man comes online to talk about his personal, his, something very private as marriage, right? And call out his wife. Mm -hmm. His wife who's very famous, more than him. I mean, we wouldn't have known him even without Lady Boss husband. Yeah, Lady Boss husband. Yeah. And when he comes online and, and you know, share all these details about mm -hmm. what really went, what according to his own side, what mm -hmm. really went down, cheating, how many men she was allegedly <laughs> sleeping with, you know, how she took his money, you know, all these things. What kind of taste does that leave on your tongue? I mean, the thing is, first of all, right, um, I really have very little to say about this because it's, it was all over the place. And then, first of all, it's, it's marriage. Mm -hmm. There may be other things which are played behind the scenes, which we will, not, we will never know. We will never, we'll never, be, we'll never know. And then you, you find him saying all these things, and then you have people taking sides, which is fine. But then, man, it's crazy. Did, did you feel bad as a man? Like, you know, women talk. We, we talk. We can come on and be, eh, eh, you know, emotional and all that. Yeah. But when the man comes on, I do, does it, does it, do you take him seriously or less seriously? Along the um, Obviously, I don't, I think that Pai Yumbi is not a serious man. <laughs> they, they, I understand. That guy is a young man. <laughs> I understand, I understand his hurt. Yeah. yeah. Um, because uh, most of, I mean, marriage is not something that anybody anybody should take lightly mm -hmm. and to be cheated on repeatedly if that is true allegedly repeatedly to be cheated on um, like that and the type of suggestive messages that she was sending to she, she allegedly sent to other men um, I think that he he was definitely hurt however I think it speaks a lot about the type of man if that's not too much of a word for him <laughs> that he is because you see, um, while explaining his own part of it, while, you know, not his own part, he, he, that, that was the only version of gotten, he actually talked about how he was virtually micromanaging her life, mm -hmm. about how he was following her up. And, and I think that her response to it was about how controlling he's been, yeah. you know, things before and after. My, my own, my, so, so to me, I don't think that... Um, that was the right channel. That was the right channel. Yeah. But I think this was a man who was bent on humiliating Lady Pons. But he has been humiliated as well. Yeah. In as much as, wait, wait, in as much as, it, 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 is, it is easy. I think that it is easy for, for women and men to, to, to pity the woman in any relationship, mm -hmm. depending on what really went down though. Um, it is easy. But if, if it, it's also not, not, not fair to not say, to not put everything based on the fact that somebody was emotionally damaged at that point yes he, he, he was a desperate man seeking for every attention he could get just to say whatever i wanted to say and it, you know mm -hmm. and i think maybe he has apologized for it by the way he has apologized for coming out and talking all that not those things that he said um but the damage has already been done i think i'm not sure that marriage is going to work anymore mm. I, I doubt. um i don't know whether allegedly she's going to go back to her alleged boyfriends and live her normal life that she's been living before. But I, all, I also feel that if you're getting married to this man, you should have known him better. You should have known that shit like this can go down if, or rather, if, if everything if, goes if off. If a man is getting married to many points, you should know the kind of woman she is already. I mean, she's, she's, first of all, she's a star. What do you mean? I, I'm, like, I'm, okay, if I'm marrying a cheat, I'll be like, yeah, she's no, going to cheat on me. I'm, I'm, no, I'm, I, 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 think, I think that, to me, I think that um, because I actually do believe that um, there is a lot behind the scenes that we do not know, exactly. and that and that lady pawns, lady pawns. Yeah, but, but this this is a relationship that has lasted more than a year, right? Um, some thirty seconds. The, the, um, this this is this is something which I don't. I think um, it speaks to 
how a lot of women get into commitment. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you, you are in a relationship which is really bad. There is a controlling man, mm -hmm. and you hope that marriage would change him. Change him. What do you hope? It would not. And I say it doesn't apply only to you. But I, I also want to talk about the double standards here. Yeah. That if this guy had cheated on Lady Pons, and Lady Pons came online to talk about it, people would have said, ah, but he's just being a man. Mm. We've seen that with the Nigerian actress who went um, to cuckoo to crazy. To, to the, uh, yeah. Yes, uh, uh, Uncle Tonto. We've, we've seen these things, you see. So there, there is always a top, double standard like, oh, you know, she, yeah, um, if, a woman, if a man cheats, well, he's just being a man. If a woman cheats, well, she's a whore. So, yeah. so to me, not that I, I, I would not support cheating, but, but I just think that, first of all, there is a lot in the backstory mm -hmm. that we don't know about. I think that the conclusion here is that both of them are hurt and they should solve that problem privately. Yeah. However, but, 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 however, <laughs> now, the, bigger, the bigger picture here mm -hmm. is that she's a woman in entertainment. Yes. Yes. And there's this whole concern and issue or myth or whatever that people have with, on women in entertainment. Mm -hmm. They cannot have a relationship. They cannot stay with one man. Yes. Their successes are always tied to men, yes. sleeping with men to climb up the ladder mm -hmm. of success or whatsoever. Mm -hmm. Now, does, I think that this whole Lady Pons issue has just really messed that up for us. <laughs> because everybody's looking like, yeah, well, Lady Pons marriage can cast in one year and look at the things that we're accusing her of. I wonder what, well, whether you can be a good wife material. But obviously, I think with, when, when he, he came out saying all of what he said, publishing um, um, screenshots of, of, mm -hmm. of conversations, it was, the, the reaction was actually really different than what we normally used to have, because especially on Twitter. We had a lot of women really being sarcastic about the whole thing, like, okay, you know, what, why, why can he not just stay and save his marriage? He should be, should be for the kids. Mm -hmm. you know, so you see, that, you see that a lot of conversations around marriage is changing. And also, but then, based on, um, to, to circle back to what you think about women entertainment, I think it's a very, it's a very tough position for them, to, for, for women entertainment in general to be in, because obviously, um, it's just the stereotypes over the years. Mm -hmm. But now, you, you want to think that what the government has done right now has reinforced the whole stereotype. stereotype. But then, the reaction was actually different, very, very different than yeah. what we normally see. Well, I, I don't think it really helps. It, 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 it doesn't, but the, the, most important, the most important fallout of this story is the conflict between Lady Ponce and Mani Pella. Oh. It is giving me life. Oh, <laughs> you know, the, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so Matela Public, <laughs> we now hear about. It's mm. crazy, but it, it's really it's, that one is it, sweet. it's obvious that women don't have to support women who cheat either, and and then you know. No, then, much, no, no much to support anybody. No, cheats. nobody. Yeah, yeah, I'm saying, like coming out to blame mm -hmm. someone, like really go out. It's just, it's just, it's just a whole mess. Anyway, guys, so we are going to be closing the topic. Well, good luck to Lady Pons and her husband. Hope that you guys fix it. Are you me? Well, even you guys are not mingling after that. But you know, just go separate ways this. in peace so that everybody, the whole world can just rest. So, yeah. Biggie 237, this... Cameron's first big brother, Af big brother house is going to be happening, I think, in May. It was supposed to be, well, Corona virus. Oh my God. That's another event that can be pushed among so many others. So, Biggie 237 and the assessment of it is coming up right next. are going to meet us some other time soon but remember to follow us on all social media platforms at Decoded TV Show and also watch the show and subscribe to Decoded TV Show on YouTube.